No discussion of the skin, of course, would be complete without discussing zits. First of all, keep your hands off your face. Do not squeeze. Okay. Okay. Uh, there's certain areas of the face where if you have a pimple and you squeeze improperly, you can cause a really bad infection. You could die from squeezing a, a zit. It's actually true. I remember being told that in medical school and we all looked at each other and said, are you kidding yeah, me? Yeah, it's true. It's not usually going to happen, but uh, it's not a good idea to, to squeeze the zits, right? No, not a good and idea. What can you do to, to treat them? You can keep your face clean, mm -hmm. take your makeup off at night before you go to bed. There is the belief, of course, that Certain foods cause acne. Chocolate the is good the foods. biggest. Right. Anything that <laughs> gives you foods. even an iota of pleasure in life, folks, you have to cut out. But, but now, is fries. that really true? Is it true? It doesn't. But look, if somebody says every time they eat a chocolate bar, they break out, don't eat the chocolate so bar. Use your head. Use right. your head is always a great piece of advice. Use your medicine. head, not your hands on the pimple. And what are some of the pills that people are given by the dermatologist? Antibiotics. Okay. And things they in work. the tetracycline people, family. People probably don't know how they work. How do they work, the antibiotics? Too? They decrease the bacteria that are in your pores, mm -hmm. which have become clogged up. And these bacteria are multiplying and multiplying and multiplying, and so it reduces eat, and that. And they're eating the fat that's there and causing yes. fatty acids, and it's the, the product of the breakdown of the fat that's actually causing the irritation and the zit, yes. right? So Absolutely. the reason why antibiotics work, are there's actually a scientific reason, and it's decreasing bacteria. But you can't yes. take that every day for your whole life, right? No, you can't. So if after a couple of months of using it, you're not getting any improvement with that, and along with using the topical things that mm -hmm. you've been given, your doctor might want to test you to see if you have any kind of a hormone imbalance. What about Retin-A? Retin-A is pharmaceutical strength vitamin A, and it's great for the skin. It helps all kinds of acne. You apply it at night. Pregnant women, breastfeeding women cannot use it. It increases your sensitivity to the sun. And how about the, that scarring acne that, that kids can get? It can leave scars. What, what do you do for that? If you've exhausted every possible treatment, antibiotics, topical, Retin-A, if you've had treatments in the dermatologist's office, talk to your dermatologist about a medication called Accutane. Mm -hmm. Accutane is a serious medication. It's very high strength vitamin A orally. You take it for five months and it has an excellent cure rate. And you have to be followed by a doctor. You must be followed by a doctor, have blood tests done. It's not for everybody. Mm -hmm.